So the 715 is something that we're super excited about and we've actually been talking about for a number of years. They're kind of a factory monster truck. They're really interesting from uh, a standpoint that if all Jeeps kind of follow the form follows uh, function mentality, then these things are like that to an extreme. They started out as gladiators. Um, they are taken by the military and retrofitted uh, with more functional bits and pieces. As with a lot of these resto mods, I hit Craigslist hard, <laughs> scoured the ends of the internet looking for the perfect candidate. Um, so this one I found, this is a 1968 M715 Jeep. Uh, I called the gentleman, we talked back and forth about the car and bought it sight unseen uh, and it, it rolled up here. It was in really nice shape, it was a complete truck and then we, we tore into it and made it what it is. So the idea behind the concept of this was really to uh, deconstruct it and put it back together with an eye towards kind of the technical styling. And the only things we really retained was the cab, the door skins, uh, part of the windshield, and the frame rails. Aside from that, everything has been revisited. So you'd probably be most surprised when you stomp on it and your stomach goes and hits your backbone. It's terrifying. So we, we put a, uh, a Hell Crate motor in it. So it's a 392, 707 horsepower. It's scary. It's terrifying um, in a really good way. Uh, you're about that far from the supercharger. You know, the, there's the dash and then there's the blower right there. And when you romp on it, all you hear is that thing kicking in and it is just, it's, it's a phenomenal feeling. Both the physical feeling of it, but also the emotional, the noise, the, it, all the drama that comes with it. It's, it's, <laughs> it's awesome. It's not your typical mud throwing uh, or just slow crawling machine. It's, it's a little bit more looking at it from partially from a speed aspect, but also just, again, the technical precision that may have never really existed on the, on the original one. So we really kind of wanted that revisit of all the pieces and parts to kind of come together to be the full story of this one.